Hello class and welcome. In this lesson series, we will look at adjustments, closing transfers and the final accounts. Pause the video whenever needed. For today's lesson, you will need your textbook and your exercise slash theory book. Please make sure you have already completed these revision exercises about the trial balance. We will now shortly recap the theory of the trial balance before continuing with the new topics. What is the trial balance? It is a list of debit and credit balances, cash and bank from the cash book with folio CB, petty cash from the petty cash book with folio PCB, other ledger accounts from the general ledger folio GL, debtors from the debtors ledger which is the total of the list of debtors with folio DL and creditors from the creditors ledger which is the total of the list of creditors with folio CL. What is the purpose of the trial balance? To understand its purpose, we will first look at the meaning of each word used in the name trial balance. Trial means to test. Balance means that the one side is equal to the other side. So, the trial balance is used to test the correctness of the double entry principle, to test that the total debit balances are equal to the total credit balances. The trial balance is divided into two sections, balance sheet account section and nominal account section. Balance sheet accounts with debit balances are drawings and assets. Balance sheet accounts with credit balances are capital and liabilities. Nominal accounts with debit balances are expenses and nominal accounts with credit balances are income. We will now look at the general objectives of our next two topics, adjustments and closing transfers and final accounts. For adjustments, you need to be able to understand stock taking and stock systems and understand the adjustment for closing stock at the end of a financial period. For closing transfers and final accounts, understand closing transfers in the general journal, understand posting to the general ledger and final account section and draw up the post-closing trial balance. Homework for your next lesson. Summarize page 111 to 113 and page 119 to 120. Make sure your summaries cover the following. Financial period, accounting cycle, stock, stock taking, stock systems, calculation of cost of sales, final accounts, and the closing transfer steps. Stay safe.